Sarah Blumenthal. You know, there's a battle outside, and it's raging. It'll soon shake your windows and, and rattle your walls. Ah, the times, they are a-changing. When folky futurist, folky futurist Bob Dylan wrote those lines, he also added, the line it is drawn, the curse it is cast. The first one now might later be last. Ah, the times, they are a-changing. We've done a lot of work over the years for a little company in Bentonville, Arkansas called Walmart. No longer are they walking the halls in Arkansas talking about retail, they are talking about e-tail. It's no longer brick and mortar, it's click and mortar. Now I'm not saying that's good, and I'm not saying that's bad, I'm saying it's real. We need to in some way, shape, or form develop a plan for it. I know that each and every one of you ascribe to a business plan, perhaps a marketing plan, perhaps a long-term plan perhaps a contingency plan. You also need to have a plan that is defined by the specific changes that we all know will continue to unfurl in our world and what you plan on doing about it, how you plan on getting ahead of it. A plan that absolutely focuses on dealing with change. The most important constant in our world. You've heard it a million times. You've heard it since you were a kid. Change, change, change. It's not new. But oh, by the way, if we don't deal with it, we will, in fact, find ourselves falling short in some way, shape, or form. Like the Eastern Airlines, and like the Howard Johnsons, and like the Sambos, and, and like the Sankas, and I can go on, okay, with brands that, that no longer exist. I'm just going to read a couple of quotes, okay, written, written by Mr. Marriott. The majority of businesses that we're in today didn't exist in the company's portfolio 20 years ago. And oh, by the way, many of those businesses you invented. A critical ingredient in our evolution has been a willingness to experiment. Sometimes we struck gold, sometimes we stumbled. Change is to business what oxygen is to life. You talk about optimism, folks. This guy, at 94 years old, married his 19-year-old secretary. <laughs> that, no, no, no. That's not the optimism. Don't get too excited yet. That's not the optimism. They bought a house next to an elementary school. That's optimism. <laughs> How many of you believe in business planning? You realize what kind of business plan you've got to have to go from 2,900 to 53. I'm talking, you're talking quantum leap, folks. You're talking about strategy, vision, understanding that, I mean, can, it's incredible incredible changes. If you were to pick up the 1957, the 1957 issue of Fortune magazine, that was the inaugural issue when Fortune unveiled their Fortune 400 list. You would find that today, 163 companies on that list from 1957 exist. They're, the rest of them are gone. And of that 163 companies that exist today, less than 70 are still on the list. If you were to look back at the year 1900-1900 and look at the top 100 companies in the United States, you would find that 17 of those companies exist today. It's the speed of change. Incredible changes. Incredible changes. One ship sails east. One ship sails west. As the very same breezes blow, it's the set of the sail, not the gale. Not the wind, not the winds of change. It's the set of the sail that bids those ships where to go. You see, the same winds of change are affecting every one of you in every one of your functional areas, in every one of your divisions and departments, and every one of your clients. It's how you set the sail that defines the ultimate direction. We are at war! It is an absolute reshaped battlefield. Every one of you are fighting and ripping and tearing and scraping and scratching for share. It's share of mind, share of market, and share of stomach. You know, there's a battle outside and it's raging. It'll soon shake your windows and rattle your walls. Ah, the times, they are changing. The times are changing. But change is not new, folks. Change is not new. What's new today is the speed of change. Remember, change is inevitable. Growth is optional. And when you're confronted with change, change in the economy, change